like to today discuss uh, the web API, HTML5 web API for the storage and let's get started. Uh, basically, I have set up a div page where I can uh, get the log information and uh, this is where it's displayed and I have a button where I call this function called check storage support and I can show you the JavaScript function as very straightforward. What we are going to do is we are going to first check for the HTML5 session storage and the way to do is just check window.session storage and if it is true then we know the browser supports session storage and uh, the way to store anything in the session storage is pretty straightforward you basically take this as a key and you can put in any value as you want so I put in one key called session gore and I have assigned some value to it the next thing you can take a look at uh, for the storage APIs is called the window.local storage and it's pretty similar and you can use a key value to store the value and that's pretty much it so let's just see how this uh, API and everything works uh, let me get a copy of the handle to this function here open in browser okay so we have it right here and I'm going to open the inspector so you can kind of see what's going on and to uh, see the information about the resources you can go into the resources tab and you can take a look at uh, local storage and you can see that I had run this thing before so I had something so I'm going to uh, delete it and uh, so now we have nothing in the local storage under resources this is in uh, Google Chrome obviously and in the session storage I have nothing as well so if I just start this function and it'll call and it's, uh, basically it says uh, local storage and session storage is both supported and we can refresh and see what we have so in the session storage we have the key and the value and in the local storage we also have the key and the value so this is how you can basically store the information so one other quick thing I want to show you is that if I uh, exit this tab and just uh, start a new tab and uh, try to go in there to see the storage information the resources and uh, you'll see that the session storage there is nothing in there uh, is gone but the local storage is also gone so um, if you exit the complete window and everything else then it is gone and it's pretty temporary storage so it is kind of a good way to store uh, information instead of cookies and uh, Hope you like it. In one of the next sessions, I would like to talk about the web SQL and I'll show you the API which you can normally use. If you want to learn more, you can basically go to my website and search uh, for videos under JavaScript. And I'll put this video in there uh, as soon as uh, I have a chance to upload it. Thanks very much. Have a good day.